Hello, my name is Boyce Fitzgerald, and today we're going to talk about a specific kind of clip that I've seen selling a lot lately, just in the last few weeks, and that's environmental clips. Okay, if I open up uh, here into my black box portal, uh, by the way, you can see I'm at $14,800, which means, uh, you know, I'm coming up to $15,000. That's going to be a big milestone for me. But let's go straight to earnings. Um, what I'm seeing here uh, just recently is a big uptick in environmental clips. Today, uh, these are all filmed by Tristan Turner. There's one, two, three, four, five, six time lapses of the Mojave Desert. Uh, then another time lapse um, where I'm the, the, the videographer and the curator. So I got 100% of the earnings there. So those just sold today and those all could be considered environmental, environmental clips. But I want to show you something that is even more... Um, more indicative. Here we've got a clip from Ivan Souza down in Brazil. He is often called on, he's got a production company to, in Brazil, he's called upon uh, to document um, deforestation and forest fires, wildfires in the Amazon rainforest and we sold quite a few. Uh, there's one, this is uh, one of, of land uh, scorched by a fire that rip through there. By the way, in some countries it may be illegal to fly a drone over a wildfire, so be careful if you're going to do that. Make sure it's legal and make sure you're being safe. Um, he's also got some of organic farming that we're seeing in the Amazon rainforest or thereabouts, the Pantanal. Here's another one of a fire. Uh, these kind of fires are often set on purpose by farmers to clear the land. Um, we've got... Uh, uh, also here, this is not... Um, this, this, is, this is just a title page that I made, a title graphic that I made for climate change, and it's sold, and I've sold it a couple times. So uh, that's always a possibility. Here's another one from Brazil where they're doing logging in the rainforest. You can see obviously why these would sell. This is land deforested in the Pantanal, which is right up against the Amazon rainforest. So you get the idea, right? We sold a lot of those. I'm counting here uh, quite a few others. And here's some more organic um, food growers. This is probably uh, chocolate bean, co cacao, cocoa beans. Um, by the way, I'll just show you this clip because it's beautiful. This is the kind of thing you you think ought to sell all the time. It's just, uh, just well done. Okay, um, let me take you down to, again, we've got a number of, of time lapses which may, you know, I mean, you can consider those uh, environmental or not. But the real winner to me is this one right here. This was filmed by Royo Montero in Spain. <coughs> he cut out the bottom of a plastic bottle, taped an action camera inside of it, and uh, had it look like it was being swept out to uh, the ocean with the tide. Make sure you don't lose your action camera doing this, but that is very clever, and I think this is going to sell over and over. Um, he's uh, he's just done a remarkable job here, framing this up and and creating a a scenario where you feel like you're the bottle or inside the bottle being swept out to sea. I think that these types of environmental clips are going to sell uh, frequently. You never know what the, what's going to sell tomorrow. What I talked about uh, last week was selling uh, establishing shots. Those are always going to be in demand. You can always sell establishing shots. Environmental may be a little bit more trendy, but I think it's worth doing. So when you see an opportunity, 
don't hesitate to press record. Hope this is helpful. Please consider subscribing. Please consider joining the Black Box family. I think it's a great way to get your content out there and make a little extra money. Uh, good luck. Have a good day. Bye-bye.